welcome back to our channel. I'm Scarlett, Display of Color, and that one was the lovely this Miss is Clara. Clara. <laughs> from the Claw, the claw. Uh, Purple Claw, from Clara Lawrence's Art. And we are going to do another set of Petri dishes, minus one, um, mm -hmm. because it was brought to our attention that you would love to see the actual <laughs> process of the drink. Less goofing off, more instruction. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about that part, but yeah, you'll definitely <laughs> see it this time. More visual. <laughs> so we're using, of course, Stone Coat Art Coat, which is my go-to. Mm. And we've already got these guys filled up about halfway or about a third full of resin. Mm -hmm. We're going to do these three guys here. And we've got Ranger Pinata and Copic Alcohol Inks because we know they all work. Yep. And selection, we'll color selection. Mm-hmm. And then what, we, what we've done is we've left it in here for a little while, let the bubbles rise to the surface. We've torched it real fast and we're letting it rise again. And you can see um, there's still some bubbles in there. So we're going to torch that before we get started. Do that. It helps out a lot because after you put in your alcohol inks, no torching. It, the alcohol inks don't like it. Mm. So, And if you wait like a good five minutes, the bubbles will rise and come towards the center so you can be safer around your edges if you it so to protect your yeah not a lot dish. of heat if you can the other thing is oh, we have a stick yeah so you notice in these little petri dishes it's kind of got a 90 degree angle so it's got a sharp corner here so use your you know, i'm trying to find it with my finger and there there it is the point <laughs> <laughs> and you go around the edge gently don't poke it and scrape it or tear it but just yeah. gently beep, and that just encourages the bubbles to get out of the corners underneath once your resin's cured like so it leaves a sharp <laughs> little bubble mm -hmm. not so pretty bubble like so just a gentle right. la, la, la. i'm gonna put this in the little holder thing mm -hmm. and then we'll get ready Would you be so kind to torch that, or do okay. any of the work that Gizmoid? Just push this button. Well, there's a couple different buttons. Let me do that real quick. Okay, then. <laughs> <laughs> it's all. <laughs> Always safety first. Gloves. Mm -hmm. Okay, just do a quickie swipe. There you go. You see the bubbles popping. just go bye-bye. Love it. Love it. Your silicone will thank you. Oh, there's a bubble in the very bottom. So am I. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. It likes to do that with those guys for some reason. <laughs> you gotta coax it up. Oh, well, there you go. Then you can zap it. Swim, bubble, swim. That's so weird. Look at it. It's a lot more resin in that. Oh, but those are like a little pop. Yeah, they're on the bottom. So weird. Make more bubbles trying to get them up. <laughs> so this is just a, an art coat resin. It's not exactly a casting resin. It does pretty good with the Petri dishes. But if you're going to go with a deeper mold, go with a casting resin. And I believe Stone Coat's got a casting resin. I've never used it mm -hmm. before. Or I never have either. Okay. I've, I'm the only thing I've used of theirs is art Oops. coat. I bumped the camera. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay, so the colors Miss Claire is going to do is Copic's Barum... Barium yellow, uh, Pinata's Rainforest Green, Ranger's Limeade Botanical, those are two greens, and then the yellows of Ranger, or Lemonade and Sunshine Yellow, and then Pinata's Sun Bright Yellow. Mm -hmm. So she's going to do a whole slew of yellow and greens, and then we also have the white Pinata to push the colors down because it's a heavier, let me see it. Yes, it's a heavier. Uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and zoom ink. in on these guys, so yeah, so they don't miss. Yeah. There's so Scott and I are getting bosom buddies, and we're getting really close and snuggly. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, scooch deep in. It's a good thing Can I like her. Just run over your toe. <laughs> no, I'm good. <laughs> and then your pipe. I will squeal. Thank you. I will squeal. I will squeal. I will squeal if you run over me with my wheel of my chair. Wheel of fortune. Maybe I should shake more. So yeah, the white shake is a lot thicker. Specifically. Yeah. <laughs> Good nuts on it. Make sure the lids are. Yeah. Highly Can recommend. Can you see this? Um, a little bit, but we're primarily we'll working in that, one. and then okay. we'll scooch it in. 
So they can see about about there is where it starts cutting so off. So we'll just wait and then yeah. do, we'll, you'll have you do these two. So the big bottles here, what makes life a lot easier? The if little you don't pipette. transfer it, yeah. Yeah. Or you can always transfer it to one of the smaller bottles. You can just squish bottles, it up. That's true. Which is what I did. <laughs> we'll do that for now. Okay. My colors. Mm -hmm. colors My colors. You gonna do your colors? Oh, I thought you were doing these and I was doing that. No, you do one, I do one, and then oh, we play. For sure. Okay. I guess there's kind of a couple of different plans here. <laughs> well, you had originally only filled one, remember? That's true. That's true. That might have been the plan originally. Okay. But things change. That they do. Look how these grow. I just love watching it. Just grow, bloom, and grow. Bloom. So basically, what happens is, is you use an alcohol ink. You apply your dots, mm -hmm. you follow the dot with See, a dot of the pinata white. And the, the pinata white is much heavier. Let me get some in the pipette. There we go, that helps. So you follow with the dot of the pipette. Uh, oh, love da 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 pinata white. There we go. And it kind of pushes the alcohol ink down. Of course, I can't see where I'm dripping. Oh, sorry. Because I'm hugging the ink. Oops, 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 okay. Oops. So some people will do a drip at a time, followed by a drip of white, or you can cover your palette with color and then go back and cover your palette again with white. So it's up to you. I prefer to do a drip and the color followed by the white because equal, you know, equal amount of drips to equal amount of white because that's what will push it down and then the next color you push that down through the other colors. That's why I prefer. But you do your thing, everyone. I'm going to do my thing right here. <laughs> what? I said I'm going to do my thing right here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Extra twangy. <laughs> With the side twang. Oh, my goodness. This bead won't shake. Come on, bead. You doing some gold? I'm trying to. There we go. Gotta shake up these. They have a little bead in them, and any of the mixatives or metals. And this is supposed to have a bead, but I didn't hear a bead in yours. I did not hear. A bead I in like there. scraped it just to make sure. They might have a bead now. I've had that for a while. Mm. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit more. What's really interesting <laughs> is in here you'll see it continuously move. It's like it keeps on changing. Yeah, right in there. See how it's changing as the white kind of sinking down? It's pushing the ink in. Let me zoom back out so you can see what Scarlett's doing too. And both sides will look different. Mm -hmm. All right, what are we going to do now? Did I mention highly addictive? Mm -hmm. I think I did. Super fun. Dudes. All right, I'm like, for sure, we could do another one to show you. <laughs> Twist my arm a hair. Right? <laughs> no worries. No problem. Boom. Oh, it's probably the closest to chemistry as I'm going to get. There <laughs> <laughs> you go. I'm just trying not to knock it over. Yeah, that too. Trying to see over my hand. Mm -hmm. Through your head. So if you accidentally, I don't know if you can see what I, mine happening here. If you accidentally get double drip, then double drip the white on that same one. Is your what? My burp. I made my pipette burp. Oh, I didn't hear it. It wasn't okay. actually me. It was the pipette. <laughs> <laughs> sure was. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, I'm capable of doing some burps. <laughs> me too. 
I'm actually really Rose will good tell, at it. tell me, good one, mom, or really? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you're just jealous. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, I got all my colors this time bought. So you can put too much color, so you got to be mindful of that too. Depending okay. on how shallow it is or deep uh, of a resin thing. Um, but ooh, I got hair. But either way, like you got to be just mindful of all that because you don't. You want to be able to see it actually do its thing, which is like drop down those drops. And if you put too much color, then usually it just kind of murks together and you don't get that definition that strong. True. And also when you use gold, the gold will kind of float to the surface on here. Sometimes you'll get a little bit that'll go down, mm -hmm. but you'll have a lot of gold on the, on the back side of it. Depending Which on it stopping helps here. definitely to push it yeah, with the white. Cover these up so I don't knock them over. Because it did, we did get a little on that one we did, wherever it may be. Uh, but you could see some of the goldfish through, so that was cool. True. All right, yeah. I'm gonna bring you in. Bring you in for close up. All right. Let's see. Focus. Which I think is everybody's problem with videos nowadays. For Okay, come on. You're gonna be still moving, all right, cool. You just don't seem change and move. There it goes. Ah, here we go. So if you see, it's still percolating. Pretty. Let me see if I can get my finger in there. See how this area is still kind of moving still? Mm-hmm, right here. So it gets really oh, interesting. Right there. There you go. Wait, hold on. I'm just gonna make sure that I didn't drip and mess it up. <laughs> There, you see it slowly right swirling. So it's a fun thing to do because it's always a surprise when you pull them out. It's like a Van Gogh painting, the way it's rolled. It's really pretty. That's I love pretty. that. Oh, thank you. Good job. <laughs> I like your purples and blues and pinks. I like the hot, uh, the thank pop you. of pink in there. Mm. Did you use pink or? Mm -hmm. It's a um, magic, or Senorita Magenta by Pinata. Nice. And Indigo by Ranger. Rich Gold by Pinata. And Baja Blue by Pinata. For the colors I use. Right. Which she will be putting pictures of because we remembered to take them. I took them this time. Uh -huh. <laughs> and we'll I didn't take them, them on the, uh, the, the last one. Sorry, mm -hmm. guys. All right. And we're going to swap here. Very mm -hmm. good. Did you want to put that in the thingy? Not yet. I'll put that in when we're done. Oh, okay. That way we can in business right there. All right, let me torch it. Yeah. A couple bubbles so are being annoying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. What's your plan? <laughs> What's yours? What's yours? <laughs> Go ahead, do it. You want to do oranges this time with your yellow? Ew. And some... Yes. Or wait, did we do that last time? Oranges and reds. What do you think about some reds? Oh yeah, I'll just do another bloodbath. I was just about to bust out. There we go. All the things. There's a dark, dark, like uh, almost. Yeah. There we go. And see if you can find a bright orange. I think there's a pinata bright, bright orange. Really? Yeah. Why not? There's a calabaz orange. That'll work. Is it legit pretty bright orange? No, just this is it. Oh, all, that's all their the colors are orange. so, all their colors are so bright. Oh, that's why I was, I was sorry. That a long time ago. Um, let's see, and you've got the yellow one in here. So this time, uh, we're gonna have to get another picture. <laughs> that's all right. I could do that with my phone. So we got yellows, reds, a little bit of pink. 
Yeah, read the names. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Pinata Sunbright Yellow. Um, Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What does it say? I'm going to botch yeah, that out. Yeah, but you're like, Calabonzo. That. <laughs> Cranberry. Orange. Ranger. Like orange. <laughs> orange. Orange. And then a bunch of uh, Copic colors, but they're pretty much done in codes on this one. Uh, crimson, lips lipstick pink, light pink, red and violet. red violet. So. Mm-hmm. I kind of like how it went from dark to light on the green and the yellow. You want to kind of do that? Yeah. Okay. So I guess the dark part, we can go with a... Let me take a picture. Oh, sure. <laughs> I was like... Queen, you kind of see it. Here, I'm going to well, get it closer. Well, it's not just being OCD. Oh, okay. <laughs> they can co-mingle. Yep. So you have proof we got pictures now. <laughs> oh. Words are like my way. There you go. I don't know if they'll stack them. They don't take much room, so. Yeah, that'll work. Mm -hmm. I use my glove box to like stack them up when I'm doing them. Smart. So I can have two heights. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Bam, get your art on, girl. Done. Get your art on. Done, done, and done. <laughs> all right. So we'll do like last time where you could put the colors and all into the white. This will be the last time that you couldn't see. You get to do colors too. Of course. Load them up. I'm going to start dark area. I'm going to work with the cranberry and the. the